Why can't I get this? It's not possible to hire Charles for the historical reasons. No, I don't want Charles. <laughs> that explanation is just so funny. Historical reasons. And my ruler already died. 1449. Yes, guys, I finally got convinced to go ahead and play as Burgundy in EU4 multiplayer game. This is an MP game with almost 50 players, where we've got players like England, Castile, Portugal, Pope, Venice, Bavaria, Bohemia, Brandenburg, Denmark, and Sweden, all around us and Hesse trying to make our life hard. How it's gonna go? You better fasten your seatbelts and let's get started. So, as for Burgundy, it is a bit different. You see, we have more provinces than in Vanilla. Our subjects are also a bit different, but let me just head up everything first when I'm gonna explain it to you. Uh, let me rival England, uh, rival Savoy and rival Milan. Then we will turn off all of this as we don't need them now. Set up our estates. So we're gonna take Adyumana, standard, Milmana, Diplomana, and then uh, Sisland. Let's uh, take higher loyalty of clergy. And Diplo Rep from nobility will take Manpower, Supremacy, and the General. My from the bourgeoisie will take Prestige, 1% loans, Space Bar goes brrr for economics. And that's it for now. Then I'm gonna start uh, building armies in one. I know somebody's talking to me in the voice chat, but I have to check something at work. I cannot listen to him. Um, go for the diet. Nobility should give us. Yes, the manpower mission. I think it's nerfed in the mod actually, uh, but it's still something. Take the general. Not bad. Take these two guys as a general. Set up some advisors. I should have some that are cheaper, like these two. And they are 50% cheaper, this one. I don't think I have anything cheaper here, so just take trade efficiency and... I don't think I have anything cheaper here, so just take... Oh god, it's nothing interesting. Morale damage. Then, turn off our armies. Hide the troops. I'll also go to nobility and... Uh... Oh, I cannot take uh, strong dashes with these guys, okay. So let me just go to my subjects now and start improving relations with the strongest. We do have a mission that requires us to get them below one liberty desire, so I'll be aiming for that. Uh, why this guy should be sent to protect trade in the English Channel, and this guy should be turned off. As for our subjects, so they are PUs, but they're not a standard PUs, because I'll be able to annex them after 10 years, or 15 years to be, uh, to be exact. These PUs give me manpower. So they're a bit stronger, and uh, they are a big, strong uh, addition to our force limit. So actually this is balancing us out to um, to France a lot. No, Burgundy yes, are mech. They're okay early on especially, because one of armies is there, Merrick maintenance, but then it's like mech, mech. This was super strong before they changed Merrick's. There's discipline, trade, France, a bit of manpower and good spurs. These are really mech. I think I can send Loyalist, but that won't make them below 10. I'll do that later. Yeah, for now I don't want to waste money. Let's improve relations first. Will you form another country then? Maybe? We don't know. Everything depends on early game. Before I, I took power points, I should have uh, made the vassals all loyal with the decision, then pick the uh, pick the mission and go get a CB, so I could attack really early on. So that was a oopsie, uh, but we'll make it work, don't worry. I think I could make these guys more loyal by taking an advisor. For Diplo, it's for Diplomatic Reputation. Let's take him. So this is 30. And this is minus 20, right? So we need to get them. Is it for all of the subjects that we need to make it done? All subjects. So Nevers is fine, I just need to fix with the PUs. Glicor Act, we don't need it. Gets uh, stability to one ready. Our ruler is calm. So that's really good. I have got some deals. I will expand. Don't worry about this. This is France, for example, as well. We have rivals. Uh, only like in game ones, you know. Okay, sure, I can take just from the first. They will be still loyal. Like uh, the in game ones are England, Savoy, and Milan. Probably England long term, anyway. Because they. Uh, 
they, they tried making a deal and tried to sell because of exaggeration. Just they told me they won't hold English Channel. <laughs> you know, it's more like an insult than a proposition for Burgundy. So who's to be released for one one promise? Was maybe Luxembourg then. Let's release Luxembourg. Take strong duchies. Okay. Yeah, that would be taking too much time to improve this decadent relations. Brabant. See? Brabant is uh, gonna take time. I could Devon once or twice. Please. Whenever I can just cancel diver trading. Yeah, we just have to get Brabant to. Below 20. You see that uh, Emperor cannot defend Lorraine if I declare this CB. I took power points before uh, before dealing with this mission. So they have liberties I increased from development because of my low car lands. Yes, I can increase land ownership, but that will be like 10 death clicks. More than the 10 death clicks. It's like 0.2 per death click, so... Yeah, it's 20 death clicks I need to get it to 10%. Why can't I get this... It's not possible to discard Charles for the historical reasons. No, I don't want Charles! <laughs> that explanation is just so funny. Historical reasons. Okay, I will do two death clicks. Just click it before it updates. Okay, now that I got them loyal, I can stop siphoning. I mean, stop supporting loyalists and start diverging trade from everyone. You see that instead of 14 income, uh, we need another month ticket for it to update. You see, it's now 20 income, so making a lot of money even with this army. I can actually make it this. Now, we'll go ahead and declare war on France. And of course guys, please do remember to leave a subscription on the channel to get notified about all of the future content because I know that half of you are not subscribing yet. And we're gonna request them to give us Normandy. That's my deal with France. They're gonna give me Normandy guys for free. I mean, it's gonna be a bit of AE. That's why I wanted to declare it ASAP. They you start dropping before I go after Lorena. So we're gonna make it not 30% in English channel, but even more. Let's see for a month tick for it to improve. Oh, that's still pretty good. Uh, what in return? In return we are allies. See, now when we turn off the unnecessary forts, we are making six ducats a month. No, I will not give him Burgundian lands. He wanted to keep the border as we started with, but I negotiated Normandy for us because this English channel he will not need these promises. And thanks to his Congress, actually get got to ten percent of Crownland. Let's take a look at the alliances. France is allied to no players. Venice is allied to no players. Castile allied to Portugal. It's also changed with the subject. And Pope, Pope allied to Castile, uh, Bohemian. One v one with uh, Brandenburg. They are both players. Hungary, no allies. Poland, no allies. Lithuania, no allies. Moscow allied with Sweden, and Denmark allied with uh, Brandenburg and Bavaria. England allied with no one. So there are not that many play alliances in Europe. It's going full marks viable EMP. Vanilla, yes. But the issue is, long uh, like late game, it's not useful because late game usually have much more money with amount of marks. Mid game, it's top tier. Late game, mech. But on this mod, not really because we have limited amount of mercs. Everyone has the same amount of mercs. Like, what? Emperor is not able to defend target nation when using that castle's belly. But they will protect. Guys, am I gonna get trolled? Why is this CB not working? 
Yes, maybe it is a visual bug, but you know, I don't want to get trolled by going to war with Austria. <laughs> but it is a visual bug. It's a big risk. That's another thing that I should have tested. Two soldiers, they have many less troops than us. No, they're... I, I don't have a CPU on lands. Only have... I, mean, I, do, I have only conquests for my subjects. I don't have my own claims yet. They will be coming with this. Let's do it. Let's wait four years to be sure. I'll wait for the player to become an emperor. Because there will be even 1450 that will choose a new emperor. Which is gonna be Denmark. Could just also wait for the tech 4. Yeah, I think that's even better idea. Let's just wait for tech 4. Because player can screw me. If it's, especially if it's Denmark. Okay, anything else? Papa relations. Um, oh, improve relations for 25 years. So I have uh, to insult England. And for insulting England, I will get that mission done. Won't I? And then France. And France has. France has to be a rival as well. I think it's both rival and insulted. That's a good requirement. Look, I can start with an insult. You see, it's not enough. I have to rival him as well. So I just change Savoy into France. And now I can click it. That's improved relations. That's gonna, you know, this is gonna drop even faster. France is fighting Brittany. Uh, when I'll be able to cancel him, I can cancel right away, actually. Let's make Savoy rival again. It's changing the mod. It's much more flexible. Yeah, now we'll just uh, take the technology and attack. I think I'll go ha have to fight Austria, it's fine. For this, what do I need? Yeah, it's not, not gonna happen. Secure election, PSD states. Let's take this. Let's go to war. I'll blame Sealand if I will have to fight Austria. And yeah, just before I declare, I can show you the play map. It's either bugged, or it's not. It worked! Yes! There's no Austria in this world, yes! <sighs> <sighs> now we can play. Why are you showing that they will join then? God damn it. I'll just keep mercs on that siege. Just to make sure the AIs will, will take care of it. That's plenty of AE. But you see the nation, yeah, I need like three years for most of them to leave it. Which is perfectly fine. And my ruler already died. 1449. 1449. Remember, the rulers fight like 554. Why it always it always happens in my games in MP. They always die early on. I can at least use the option to educate ruler. Which is uh, part of the mod. For Haran Dakas, I can increase ill of his stats by 1. So he's now 315, which is still terrible, but a bit better. What will happen when Charles dies? I don't know. I think it's changed the mods, but how it is changed? I really don't know. Oh, there it is. Castile uh, Morocco War. It's happening, guys. It's just Castile versus Morocco. Portugal is not joining this one. Yeah, there is a Morocco player. Uh, there's a pretty good player on Castile. It's Hogotan. And I. Don't know about skill of Otto von Bismarck. Five minutes later. Oh. Morocco, did he surrender first to Castile? Or maybe he, they made a deal and uh, he gave up with Seville province. I think that's what happened. Yeah, he just gave up this province and they made a deal. Actually, Rhineland doesn't matter. In the long term, we want uh, mercantilism. Protectionism is right now more important, uh, but. Rinkat is gonna be useful to fight for English Channel with England. Booking, yeah? Oh! Is he trolling? Did he lose to Brandenburg, guys? Yes, diplomats are chilling because they did everything they had in their hands already, so improve relations with all the subjects. I could technically go and start improving relations with AIs in HRE for them to not join the coalition, but because I'm out of the HRE and Emperor will keep uh, uh, asking me for unlawful territory, I'll never get the good relations with them. 
So that's pointless. Night by peasant rebels. Ah, uh, yeah, peasant or nobility rebels are doing this. I think nobility rebels are releasing country inside you. That's what probably happened. That's A of a place around us. Okay, getting better. Oh, Sweden took a uh, whole. Uh, how it's called? Livonia. Alliances. These guys are still not allied to each other. Could take the meal tech. Yeah, that's innovativeness. It's too so. Oh, they're fighting between each other. The Apanages. A uh, maximum bar should be one of the biggest. Yeah, only France has the same amount of us. Of the Empire as us. Much more development though. I thought I would be able to scaling everyone around uh, thanks to our good ruler, but he died in 1449, so it's not happening. I can't check that much. <laughs> I see this. What is Ottomans fighting? Karaman. Mamluks are losing to Ethiopia. Oh yeah, losing heart. Is he bankrupt? Yeah. F. So Denmark is not player war apparently. He's Poland. Everything is done direct. Polish conquest of Vratislav. Ah, they attack, attacked Silesia. So Denmark's probably not doing anything there. So for the Golden Era, I'm looking for development in the capital. So I think that's most most developed province. And... And Renaissance. We can get some um, flagship now. And so make a heavy ship with more cannons. Shoot three power and morale. Oh, I need an error. Not possible due to power variance succession crisis. I just want the crisis. Maybe I'll annex these guys after all. I don't actually want to annex them for now. I need them in power. So if I wanted to annex someone, I would be annexing uh, Nevers and Luxembourg. Uh, because they are not giving me manpower. And I might actually go ahead and start annexing Luxembourg, but I need to improve relations with them first. So first reform here. Maybe to attack Spenta guys. And then power might be a bit more useful. 46,000. 50,000 maximum power. Is really all of these guys versus Bohemia? I would hope not. And I was supposed to start annexing Luxembourg. Um, but I'm really wondering about giving uh, Leash and Loom to Luxembourg. So. Uh, Maybe I'll start the next thing after the next war, and now we'll just start with Nevers. It's gonna take like less than two years. In the meantime, just keep improving relations with all of these guys. I think that is dropping pretty fast actually, it's around 30. I think I can attack Leash. It's just Strasbourg and Cologne. See, Emperor is not in that war. We will be a great power again. Oh, stability. That's extremely useful. Uh, let's peace out Cologne. For money. Break some relations, just stack prestige. Yep, yeah, there goes Nevers. Which uh, gives us Integrate Nevers mission. And it's claims on uh, um, Switzerland and Savoy. So uh, this promise I could take them. And uh, yeah, this is about taking this promise back. Let's peace out Strasbourg now. Same case for reparations. Break some of this. Just for a matter of PP. And now just waiting for the last war. Two elections of Luxembourg. That will be the next call to of integration. I was E. Yeah, I can take it down already. But this, uh, yeah, I'll take them for myself and then give to Luxembourg. How much of Crown I'm gonna get out of it? 3.2. Oh, yeah, I can turn off armies again. No rebels really loading. I need other mana, so I'm gonna give it to Luxembourg. Now, annexation cost of Luxembourg is 250. They still, of course, have to core these two provinces, so the cost will be a bit bigger. I will find. Please just tell me they're gonna start coring it. They start coring this one. Yeah, both of them. Nice. Okay, I'll turn off the forts. I, have, I need Honchkont to decrease devastation here. Not so much more. And let's turn off the others. 
Are we annexing any of these appanages? We don't have slots for our alliance. Going to form Lotharingia, we don't know what we're gonna form yet, that will depend really on the situation. It's gonna be Lotharingia, it's gonna be uh, the Netherlands, it's gonna be Great Britain, it's gonna be France, it's gonna be Byzantium, it's gonna be Texas, depends. We'll see. It's not something that we uh, decided yet. We are focusing on the lowlands right now. That's our goal for like very early game, to get lowlands and, and scale. Which we are doing. So we already at 30th income, 30th of first limit, 51,000 maximum power. As French AE, Oof, even worse than ours. The same nations could join his coalition. As uh, Brandenburg, Munich, England, Steel, Portugal, Marco, Dons, Lithuania, Poland, Finland, Muscovy. It's just nature. Uh, Lithuania, Lithuania, Venice, Pope. Yep. Everyone, this is, yeah. It's really easy to bait. Oh yeah, let's unlock uh, first just an idea group and it's gonna be humanist and just gonna count to get an event for idea cost. But I'm gonna later change it to something military. I just don't know what yet. I think I'll go standard upper of quality echo. Oh, yeah, we need navy quality. For sure quality echo. As long as we're not hitting points cap, it's fine. This tech is also super important. That's six years ahead of time. Yeah, I need to think if we call it just in case. It, like England was pretty, pretty straightforward that he wants my provinces. Uh, no. Ooh, seeing the real you. Hello there, noble the Bourbon family four four four. Welcome. How we should name him? Give him propositions in the chat, guys. I don't think he should be Philip the Bourbon. What should be the first name of this heir? I know, Grzegorz. Brzezczykiewicz. Is this good enough? Let's go. Grzegorz Brzezczykiewicz de Bourbon. Yeah, we really have to test the Bourbon inheritance to see, first of all, what events are in the mod, and second of all, like, if they're gonna be annexed or what, should I annex them manually? But that, let's start annexing Luxembourg. If I can join the HRE for this. How much is it gonna take? So yeah, I should finish today. Let's plot your development, right? 15, 27, 40 development we have in Luxembourg. So I'll be able to become a kingdom because I'm a duchy. My golf is gonna hurt. I'm, I'm already a duchy, you know that. So it's not gonna be different with this right now. And if I become a lector, which is Easy because Milan is not a player, for example, and he's gonna die, or, or, or Bohemia. Then uh, I can get a deal with Emperor to give me a lecture, so I'll be able to be a kingdom. But I did not decide it, guys. Oh, this is. Um, somebody took the mill deck! Surely for the war. VJ is still fighting with uh, Bachmanis. It looks like Delhi is also involved. Inca is fighting. Why is Inca fighting with G VJ? The hell. Jabahit is fighting with Malacca. At least we don't have to take it so much ahead of time. There's some more rebel. Oh, 34 already. This is good. I like the increase. We build up my army as well, just to have it around the first limit. Why you know? Not being on full manpower, so I'm on the, the limit of manpower now. It's not really like recovering anything. I only need Ahen, right? Yeah, the AE is abysmal. Morocco declared on Mamluks. Yeah, yeah. Morocco is playing nicely, but that's because he made a deal with Castile. Which is probably a good decision. Where is he taking these troops? Do you see this? This took like 20,000 troops on the ships. Is it worth Epirus and Ragusa? What? English conquest of Malta.
He does have a claim from the mission too, but why would he conquer that? Let's surrender. So we just take stuff from these guys. Uh, reparations, money. And this. Prestige. Um, from Aachen, also reparations and money. Dead? How can Moscow die so fast? Okay, so actually crashed, not decked. Okay, let's finish here. Maybe Sweden, Lithuania, Repeam. It's a good moment to finish the session. They can talk about this between the sessions. What do you think, guys? Should we attack England next week? Let me know by liking this video and commenting it. Bye-bye!